walking toward the gravel road he's driven down for 51 years. I, I see a bus up here parked and I figured they brought my bus to surprise me. But Lyle Divich was in for a bigger surprise than he thought. I'm looking and there's buses all the way around the curve this way, all the way up to that hill. So I cried like a baby. Seven in all, sent to Lyle's house by the East Butler School District to greet their beloved driver and offer support. Once a tiger, always a tiger. And that's truly how we operate here. Um, we are family, we take care of each other. Just like how Lyle took care of families for generations on his school bus. So he not only drove myself, my husband, all of our siblings to school and my kids, um, he also drove my grandpa where he needed to go to the cemetery on Memorial Day. Little did Lyle know what he signed up for when the superintendent hired him as a farm kid. He threw me the keys and I looked up in the mirror and the, uh, kid, uh, the bus was packed with kids and I was on my own. There was no uh, t training or tests or nothing. The school trusted Lyle as a former student who grew up driving tractors through the Bohemian Alps. In all kinds of conditions, in a very dangerous conditions. And it's funny I'm alive because there, well, you see the hills we're in. At first, the school paid him $100 to drive a kindergarten route, but now he's familiar with the entire district. On this map, the brown string represents Lyle's bus route. He covers communities between Brainerd, Dwight, and Valparaiso. Despite never having kids of his own, Lyle handed out candy bars, attended many weddings, and is even a godfather to one of his passengers. His kids describe him as very loyal. Loyal is just the word that keeps coming to mind. He stopped driving the bus this spring when he was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. Then Lyle's nurse called the East Butler superintendent in the fall. The question was, Mr. Eldridge, would you consider allowing the buses that come by Lyle's house on um, soon? And I was like, of course, of course we would. I wouldn't I didn't even think about it. It was the perfect way to thank a beloved member of the Tiger family. Like I have school, uh, insurance under the school pot and they never took it from me or nothing. And he said, we'll do anything for you, Lyle. So they treated me really good. For Pure Nebraska, I'm Grace McDonald.